Hi guys, what's going on? So today I'm back with another video and today I just really want to talk to you guys about my goals in 2017. So this year I've set new resolutions, well to be honest not really resolutions but like things I want to achieve and just want to, just to achieve really. So um, first of all I want to start off with like powerlifting, not really like full on just forgetting bodybuilding and going full on powerlifting. I want to start incorporating more strength activities and more strength exercises into my workouts. So um, for example if I was doing like a push day maybe I'll do like a chest uh, workout so I'll like try to be uh, improving my strength on the bench press by doing 5x5 five five sort of thing. And I want to document that with you guys, same for the squat, same for the deadlift. And I'm only really going to be working on the three main pulls. Um, so the squat, the deadlift and the bench um, as part of like a strength gaining process because that's what powerlifters do right. So um, I'm going to be doing that and then at the end of my workouts I'm going to be incorporating a bit of hypertrophy and um, or hypertrophy as some people say um, into my workouts so like some accessory work which is still bodybuilding. So I'm going to be doing so for example the bench press I'm going to be incorporating more chest and tricep after the bench press um, after I've done all my strength gains and all my strength reps and sets so um, for example I'll be going into like dumbbell press or maybe tricep push downs and I'm just going to be doing maybe three to five sets of each each exercise afterwards and incorporating maybe 10 to 12 reps or if I still want to work on a bit of strength go from six to eight reps um, which is going to help me a lot as in power and um, mainly just endurance within the muscle group so um, yeah as I said I'm going to be doing that for deadlift, squat and um, bench press and that's something really, I really want to achieve this year and bring up um, as I help, think this will help me a lot with like physique and overall bodybuilding itself because all, all in all you have to live heavy to gain muscle so yeah. Number two, at some point this year I really want to do a cut um, go into a like small deficit at the moment i'm in a lean bulk um so i'm going to stay in this surplus for a few more months and i want to start this cut around may around may 20th and i want to document as much as i can for you guys and just almost bring you along and hopefully you can learn something about dieting and um still training um like when you're dieting and sort of exercises to do and how to manage stress and um yeah, so that's something I'm going to be learning for myself too. And um, yeah, so I've never done that before, so I'm really, really excited for it. I can't wait. Um, I'm, I think I'm going to do a 60-day cut, not a three, not a three-month cut, um, as people usually do, or like 16 weeks, however long it is. Um, but it's, again, it's personal preference, and I just want to do it for myself. I'm not going to be stopping, um, standing up on stage, posing, or doing any men's physique shows or bodybuilding shows. Um, as I feel I'm not like quite big enough yet for it I don't really have the confidence for that quite yet and I'm just going to be doing it for myself testing out my knowledge for myself and um, yeah document it for you for you guys so I can look back at it uh, look back at it so you you guys can watch it and um, yeah hopefully learn something as I'm going to be learning through the whole process myself as I haven't done it before um, and really I just want to see the physique I've built um, over the last year and a half or so so um, yeah, I'm really excited for that. Hopefully get some great results and um, yeah, it's going to be good. So that's something else I want to do this year. Um, I'm really looking forward to it. And um, yeah, I hope you guys will enjoy it too. Um, like whilst you're watching the videos, I'm not going to be doing like daily vlogging. Um, I won't be in the position to do that. I won't have enough time to do that. I won't be able to like manage the recording and the editing at the same time on top of like schoolwork. Um, I'm not sure when I'm going to be finished my A levels this year. Um, they do start in May, like around uh, like the start of May, um, but I'm not sure if I'm going to get away with um, the end of May. But I definitely don't think I've got any in June or July, which is good. So I'm going to be doing a 60 day cut, um, hopefully starting around May the 20th. And um, yeah, really looking forward to that. So that's my second one. It's on my third one. Um, which is going to be really, really um, like tough and exhausting, but I really, really want to accomplish it and um, just almost like go somewhere with it, you know? Like I want to 
sort of start up something for myself, just a little small little um, earning based um, like business sort of thing. Um, I don't want to like start like employing people and all that stuff. I just want to start up a little something for myself and um, something that can get me that extra income um, to help me out a bit more. Um, so I can like buy more equipment for the make better investments, uh, more equipment to do things like YouTube. Um, more camera equipment for like photography, videography, things like that and um, yeah I can drive this year too so that's going to help out a lot to be stable enough really. Um, so yeah I'm really excited about that. I'm, I have a sort of uh, a few ideas which I've like buzzing in my head of uh, like a few things that I want to do um, within like this little business venture. Um, Again, I've never had a business before. I do business. Um, I've, had, I've got lots of ideas for the future, um, which I can't reveal, unfortunately. But um, yeah, I'll let you guys know when it comes to down to it. Comes down to it. I want to start thinking about like planning it soon and start thinking about budget and um, just what I'm going to do and how I'm going to market it, sort of thing, and um, how I'm going to get like the product and my skills to the customers which is what I want to be working on soon so I'll let you guys know when I'm um, finally there and um, yeah I'm really excited for it and hopefully it'll be successful okay so fourth thing which is very important to me and I feel as though I'm doing really well on it at the moment is my YouTube so I really want to grow my YouTube channel I want to start uploading more frequently um, I want to start doing a different variety of videos I'm here on my channel now and I've got 30 videos but by the time you're watching this I'll have 31 and um, yeah it's my deadlift and um, I've had feedback on that and it motivate, motivates me a lot of my dad's friends the which powerlift um, so they've got a fantastic form on my deadlift and um, yeah like solid lift great respect and um, thank you for you guys if you were watching this video. I really appreciate it. It does motivate me and it helps keep, just keep me going overall, really. I really want to grow my YouTube this year and social media in general. I recommend rather go follow my Instagram to see what I'm up to. Um, and again, I'll be posting links to on Facebook and Twitter to um, my new videos that are going up on the channel. And um, yeah, really I just want to get a different variety of videos start posting more content more frequently and yeah I just want to give more information to you guys and to help you guys out as much as possible so that you could learn something as you know I want to test my test my knowledge and um, start using it on different people maybe I could like get some people into the gym this year um, and start you know like sort of training them sort of thing not personal training because I'm not like qualified for that and I don't have the health and safety um, cautions that um, that you need to qualify for and things like that I don't have all that so maybe I'll just get a few family members into the gym start testing my knowledge on them and um, yeah see where I can go from there taking some before and after photos see what I can do and hopefully get in more clients and start thinking about getting qualification training side of things so um, yeah that they are the three four main things that I really want to um, accomplish this year and be successful at I'm gonna try so, so hard to work towards them again I got my A levels this year so I really want to pass them as well something that I'm gonna be so that's the fifth thing actually something that I'm gonna be wanna to work towards and do great at so um, yeah I really want to accomplish these goals I hope you guys can help me out by watching these videos and subscribing to my YouTube channel um, helps me out a lot it really motivates me to upload more and give more information to you guys so i can help you guys out as much as possible and um yeah thank you for watching this video i really appreciate it uh, more lots more videos coming soon take it easy guys i'll see you later bye